Welcome back to Indian Times Daily. The top 10 headlines from Punjab are CM Arminder Singh has condemned Canada's NDP leader Jagmeet Singh's remarks on self-determination for Punjab. He said that the Canadian authorities should take serious note of such destructive elements trying to spread to Scott in India. Jagmeet had said that he considers self-determination to be a basic right in places such as Punjab, Catalonia or Quebec. The PPCB has said that the pollution level in Punjab had attained alarming proportions. It has compared the prevalent atmospheric situation to that of a gas chamber. The major cause of air pollution is double burning, the board stated. Haryana is said to be the first state in the country to provide paying guest facility for cattle. This will help cattle owners living in small houses who don't have enough space to rear the bovines. 50 to 100 acres of land will be earmarked for the initiative. Blood samples of family members of 9 of the 39 the Indians missing in Iraq have not been collected. This is because the designated health centre in Amritsar does not have DNA test kits. The centre, in collaboration with Iraq, has started a fresh search to trace the Indians. CM Amrinder Singh has lashed out at the SAD. This is for allegedly misleading the people over the government's loan waiver scheme. Amrinder alleged that the SAD was concerned only about promoting its own political and personal interest. The Aam Aadmi Party is set to release a short film in Chandigarh to expose the alleged misdoing of the three-year rule of the Haryana BJP government. Aam Aadmi Party President Navneen Jaihan alleged that the government had spoiled the brotherhood in the state. The PSERC has announced the new power tariff for Punjab for a period of three years. It has been increased by 9.33% over the existing tariff. The Punjab and Haryana High Court has snubbed the Haryana government for its failure to submit a status report on the investigation into the alleged kidnapping and rape of a minor in Fatehabad district. According to the petitioners, the relatives of state BJP President Subhash Barala are the main accused. Several unsolved cases, including the recent murder of RSS leader Ravinder Gosain, are a challenge for the Punjab police. DJP Suresh Arora has said he has stressed the need for teamwork and coordination within the force. The centre's proposed move to impose transport tax on tractors has drawn flak from farmers' unions. This will burden farmers and others using the tractor trailer for transporting goods or material. This is the end of the news bulletin, but stay tuned to IndianTimesDaily.com as news from Bollywood is coming up next. And do visit the resources section on this portal to find the best into american businesses and resources. From accounting firms to wedding planners in your city. All of us at Indian Times Daily wish that you have a great day.